envelopes that I put together. I have some more to put in there. Here's a breakfast journal. It's not real creative, but I have this one already. These are for, oh, for these other little books over here. I put these together. With, uh, they actually go through the year with the colors of the astrological sign here. If we start with um, Aquarius in January, it's a blue violet. I'm sorry, Capricorn in January, and then to Aquarius, it's violet. And then Pisces is red violet, and Aries is red, and so on through the year, thinking that um, someone might enjoy working with complementary colors. For example, blue violet, the opposite is yellow orange. You know, and of course, this isn't a bright yellow orange. Um, you don't want to do that. You have to play with your values too. But when you're working with complementaries, and this is this is actually I'm calling it yellow, opposite to violet. It's have yellow orange, so it's a nice warm one. It's a nice red violet. And the opposite of that would be yellow green. And that's a fun combination. You see it in movies a lot. So through both of these, okay, and then I have some fun little magic paint things where you can just wet these and put paints in there for travel or whatever. See the other one. Um, I think I get a flip through on these. They're just kind of growing as I go. And I'm leaving a lot for um, a person to fill, you know, like to color these in. Or and All I'm doing is basically getting these pages treated and good to go. And these can be covered. They don't, it doesn't have to be the the month of the year. This one has a nice December in it. Uh, I love this green. Yeah. Well, this is this one. Okay. And then I uh, kind of started with this one. A bunch of words that were in the news, starting with. Um, disingenuous. I knew what it meant and I always wanted to see it uh, displayed clearly. And This man has displayed many things <laughs> clearly. Disingenuous is there. Who? Me? Um, and then some flip books here. It has note taking on um, narcissistic personality disorder. Uh, I've been working on all of that stuff since uh, actually early November. 